That's awesome. Well, yeah, my name is Amir Jules. I'm a singer-songwriter from the east side, east-north. Go east and then go up past the border. I'm in the Canadian side on the east side. Love and life. Um, but wow. yeah, I just wanted to start this with just... Uh, I'll start it with... Uh, this is like a slow R&B-ish kind of vibe just to get the mood in so you get to know and then go from there. But this song is one of my originals. Uh, you can find everywhere on Spotify and Apple Music and all over the place. Uh, this one's called Levels. So if you enjoy it. You make me fall every night Right on my knees, yeah, that's right You make me want to know where far I'll go To make your days feel so bright While I lie alone and light Wondering when and when and when I'll be alone You got me switching levels You got me switching levels yeah. You got me switching levels mm-hmm. You got me switching levels Yeah Baby girl, are you free tonight? Baby, are you feeling right? I want you here by my side, yeah. You got me switching levels, baby girl. Are you free tonight? Baby, are you feeling right? Are you free tonight? Yeah. Thank you. Beautiful. That's fun. Yeah, very. Hey, how you guys doing? I know yeah. you guys were talking for like an for an hour and like twenty minutes. How how are you guys feeling? <laughs> Good. <laughs> it's on nonstop. It's funny because like I always get drained every time I play like for an hour or straight or more. You want to walk off the stage? Like I need I need to take a breath. So I'm happy I can sing to you guys while you guys relax because an hour is a is a long yeah. long talk. Thank you. Yeah. Yeah. No. So yeah. My name. Yeah. My name is Alvin Jones. Literally. Yeah, we're like, I I started playing music when I was back 18 years old, trying to impress women. That's the only reason why we do this things as men. <laughs> Understand? There's no. There's no guy in this world who no got comment. into music no without comment, trying to impress women. <laughs> there it is. Yeah. That's how it is. So that's what that's what I did there, and then from then on, I've been playing music ever since, and. Um, talking about uh, listening because I was listening on to the whole conversation with everything because I hear you're a comedian. Is that correct? Uh, yes, I am. Okay, amazing. And then and then I'm trying to remember because so many people were talking so many times. Comedian, and then I've, the screen is so far away. I don't know anyone's names anymore. But actress. That's Susie. Susie, by the way, the actress, Hi. the other actress just left the room. Okay, she's so in the she's chat. Just, she's yeah. in the chat though. That's her in oh, the chat, in the Crystal. Chat. Nice. Oh, amazing. Okay, okay, I can see her in chat. Awesome. That's sweet. That's awesome. And you guys started, I'm assuming, like, you guys are way further in your careers than I am. I've been doing this for maybe eight years. <laughs> like, so. That's good. Awesome. That's pretty good, man. Yep. Yeah. Been yeah. trying. Been trying. It's, it's a fun, it's a fun world. It's a fun world. Writing yes. music. Yeah. No, it's awesome. But yeah, so I, I, I was, I was going to come here and just play a couple songs for you guys. Um, listening to the conversation and everything when it came to to everything. There's a couple songs that I've ever written because every every song I ever write has always been a story. I always like uh, sharing stories. Um, as a musician, when we listen to other people's stories, we don't listen to a story. We listen to how we can turn it into a song to then share the story later on. So um, that was just, as everyone was talking, I was just like, oh my gosh, this just reminds me of one of my songs. I made a song called For Today a while back. Um, I ended up getting on an Oprah Winfrey Channel movie or something and it was, it was a lot of fun. And a good wow. muscle. Nice, movie. nice. Yeah, awesome. I was very happy with that. But I was wondering if you guys wanted to listen to this one. This is for today. Um, we are at your mercy, man. Oh, there you go. Well, this you, is the story. Like, did you did you see did you see the chat, man? Did you? 
I, they love I am, your guitar. I am, they love your I, voice. They vibe everything under the sun. I just want to let you know that you you definitely going down the the right track, man. Uh, well, yes, whatever you, you so want much. to play, appreciate it. Oh yeah, no, I definitely will. Everybody on the chat and everything. If you ever want to just follow me again, my name is I think on the screen somewhere. Um, there it is. But that that is my name everywhere, all over the place, every platform whatsoever. You can just follow, support, and definitely. everything. And you know, I'm going to jump in and say this. You know, you coming out to Cali, and oh, we gonna, we're going to make some noise. One hundred percent. And we're going to do some <laughs> some live streaming. And the other thing is, expect to see a ton of him. Uh, with the music yeah. channel we got coming out, you guys, and a whole a whole bunch more. So um, oh, we got more music. Hit, I got more music. Go ahead. Man, yeah, man, you got way more on. music. Oh, yeah. yeah. Oh yeah, we're having fun. We're having fun with it. We're having fun with it. Yeah. So yeah, this is, uh, this next song is called "For Today." Hopefully, if if I if I am a good songwriter, I don't have to explain <laughs> to you what the story is, and you'll get it. <laughs> that's, uh, that's, that's how I judge myself. <laughs> this is called "For Today." You good, man? You good. Glass, secret crash, trying to make this ordeal pass, but she's not wanting to make this love last. He's ashamed, he's to blame, he's trying so hard to maintain his composure as he soars through the pain. Yeah, he was wrong to love another woman, wrong to hide it from the one he vowed to love to the end. Yeah, he is trying to put out the waves that's burning his whole life away. He drops to his knees and begins to say, For today, for today, we will fight until the night fades away. For today, for today, we will fight until we find our way. She feels betrayed, she's in a cage, mascara is falling down her face. No one to turn to, just filled with immense rage. She didn't know why he had lied, she couldn't see it all this time. Just mad at herself that she didn't see the signs. I can't believe I trusted him this way, he let me throw my life away. I can't be here, he can't make me stay. I want to get far, far away from here and put her in my review mirror, but I can't believe he had the guts to say, for today, for today, we will fight until the night fades away, for today, for today, we will fight until we find our way. Wasn't it this real or just a joke you love to play? Baby, it's not a big deal. Oh, please, oh, please, just stay. Yeah. For today, for today, we will fight until the night. Away. She said, for today, for today, we will fight until the night fades away. Whoa, oh, oh, whoa, oh. We won't fight until the lights fade away. Whoa, oh, oh, whoa, oh, oh. We can't fight because she just walked away. Beautiful. Beautiful voice. Great yeah. there. Thank you. Thank you so much. No, it's, there's it's, a lot it's, of it's, things. There's there's yeah. a lot of things that could happen in life that we have no control over, but one thing is for sure. Um um, we can hear something that just pours uh, out of somebody and it can touch us. And uh, you just did that. I really appreciate oh. it. Everybody's still doing stuff in the chat. And, and great, the great music, Almir. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you for sharing your talent with us. Anytime. Yeah, we'll see you later, my friend. Yes. Take care. Bye. Bye-bye.
Um, Can I stay for one more we, song? You know, <laughs> she's like voice. I'm gonna be kicking her out. She's like, gonna, <laughs> I know I have the like, controls to kick you out, but I'm not gonna kick you out. <laughs> yes, you, you can stay as long as you like. Uh, he's gonna play a little bit because he has somewhere he needs to take care of as well in a little yeah, while. Yeah. But I got, um, I, got, I got one more song in me for sure, and then, yeah. then got to kick Do it. your thing. Yeah. Awesome. No, but go ahead. Yeah, yeah. Okay, but question now. Okay, here's the thing. You want one more song? Do you want a fastest song <laughs> or a slower song? This is this is the biggest thing. People want to dance, want to move, or do you want to just like vibe? I'm okay, kind of I vibing right now, you... but it's up to you. Yeah, okay. No, no, she's vibing right now. I'm gonna say uh, this as the Mix host, as the host of the show. Mm -hmm. I do not, I do not make any requests. But this will uh -huh. be the first. This will be. No, it's not true. I did make a request once before. This is the <laughs> second time I'll make a request. I want a melody before you leave. You want a melody? Look at okay. that. I, I get him. I got him. Got him. Oh, damn. I want a melody <laughs> of a of a snippets, a few seconds of whatever you want to play with like no major transition points in between. Just whatever you want and then you just drop little, the just, mic. And leave. Just little a little bit. melody. Yeah. I got you. I got you. Okay. Sampler mm -hmm. of what of who who you are for everybody. Oh, best, best moments. All right. Well, in that case. I can go with. Oh wait, no, that's hard now. Now you're just like. <laughs> yeah. hey, the remember spot. the other thing I told you when we were talking? I could have done. I didn't do that one. That other thing, I'll save just, that. You know what? Okay, wait, wait. Here's this one. Here's this one. Then there's a little. Okay. okay so no, no changes. Just the melody. <laughs> I got you. I got you. Okay. This is uh, because of you. This is the chorus of because of you. There you jam go. on, jam you. on, jam on. <laughs> This is jumping right into the course is a whole different thing. That is crazy. Isn't it, a, isn't it a freaky thing? thing. It's a freaky thing, huh? It's a freaky thing. Just jump in right to the, I'll do the first verse of the course. It's all cool. This is because of you. Oh, we'll call this melody then a freaky thing then. That's what we'll right, call it, a freaky thing. Right? Yeah, there we go. <laughs> I don't care what you think of me. You could throw me into the sea. Wrap the rope right around my feet. Watch me drown so gently. Drag my name around all through the town and act like you don't know me. I'm the crazy little one of these. Go ahead and get away from me. Better off on my own. Like being alone. I never check my phone. Cause there's no room for you no more. Yeah. You were never right. Would you change my life? You're my kryptonite. And I don't need you tonight. Girl, keep moving. Keep moving on. I've had to change up my own life. It's time I walked in my own stride. I'm better losing. Better losing you. If you're wondering why life is a clue, it's because of you. Is your melody slipped? Awesome. Yeah. Sweet. <laughs> really Sweet, good. Sweet, brother. Really good. Get ready. Here, here it comes. Here it comes. Ah. <laughs> it's called a standing ovation. Virtual studio standing ovation. There you go. You get one more. <laughs> hey, thanks for doing this, my man. Appreciate it a great deal. Really do. And you got to stay, Susie, one more song. Yeah, thank you yeah. so much. I enjoyed it. that immensely. Thank you. I'm going to check you out now. Good. Find you. going to go uh, really stalk your social media. Yeah, everything. <laughs> media the, I'm what? kidding. Uh, no, well, I'm going to go find him. He's... I need more fans. No. <laughs> That's right. I'm hey, going to go. Hey, you know what? Go tell a friend. You got to tell a friend. That way you yeah. that way you gang stalk. That's right. Just, just gang stalk. I'm just going to yeah, gang don't, don't stalk just your whole Yeah, just get a bunch of people. You share it everywhere. You you Absolutely. Please do. The one thing I'll say, because again, the, the, the social media and everything is what helps artists. And it's like, yeah. follow me and then tell three other friends to follow me. That's just There you go. And you deserve it. You're awesome. Thank you. <laughs> Beautiful voice, Tim. Thank you so much. Yeah. yeah. All right. So, write, uh, oh, Susie? I have one question. Do you write sure. everything? Yes. You write all your own music? Yeah, I, I write and produce everything I've, I've, wow. I've released so far. So I write all my lyrics. I produce all my songs. And I've mixed and mastered most of them. And then I've had other people to do it because I get really in my head. So it's <laughs> very impressive. Thank you so much. Uh, I appreciate thank it. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. All right. Bye, we'll Pat. see you later, Susie. That's awesome. Super nice. You, um... You stuck it out. You listened I to did. the first half of the show. I did, yeah. So I'll ask this question. 
yeah. before we, we, we end tonight or you end it tonight, I'm going to ask you this question. Okay. If you had to say the type of relationship that you experienced in your life, did you have one in which that person was more absorbed in themselves than the relationship than you? Oh, yes. Um, Save the good that, stuff for the new channel. Save the good stuff for oh, the new channel. But go ahead. The good stuff for you. Okay. Well, like it's a lot of good. No, no, no. Yeah. No, it's um, the, the relationship I was in um, that got me to do music in the first place um, was, was the relationship that got me to understand how to express myself better like back growing up you don't know how to express yourself at all like you're you like as a kid you just you do things but you don't know how to like mold yeah. it into a way of being more mm -hmm. conclusive so i was dating this girl back in the day um and and everything everything about her was kind of just her it was kind of like no matter what happened like if if yeah. if I did said something wrong or did something wrong, it was like she'd be in the basement playing sad songs back to back to back to back to back instead of coming in and talking because it's all about like you hurt me even though I didn't even understand what I did at the time, and so yeah. like with with all of that it was kind of like uh, all that relationship was like a big ball of mess and then I will keep this these details for the a new channel but basically a lot of big things happened um, yeah. that that got me and her got me to just end it um, mm -hmm. and I didn't know how to cope. And then ever since then, I started writing music, and music was the way I was able to like write the story and cope and okay. keep it yeah, there. Yeah. So definitely yeah. like that relationship. It wasn't yeah. my first. It was that was that was the biggest one, for sure. Right. Did you find yourself um, having parts of your emotions, who you were, mm -hmm. in you that you never seriously thought existed, but they were coming out all of a sudden? Yeah, yeah, I, I could say yeah. Like, I don't know in, in to what fully, like, full crazy extent, but yeah. Like, yeah. there's moments where, I, like, right now, if I'm looking back at who I was back then. It was like, okay. I am not the person now. There's a lot of characteristics okay. I've moved very much past. Um, yeah. And it's like, like, like I, would, I, would, I would say, like, back in the day, I would basically go with the flow with everyone that says, if someone was mad at me, I'd try everything I can to, like, make it right in a sense so in a relationship okay. aspect mm -hmm. really really toxic because mm -hmm. you, if you're the problem you're you're always you always feel like you're the problem you're always going to feel like you have to fix this problem and that's not always the case so growing up i got to learn that very quickly so i could say looking back yes but i have to mm -hmm. like what but in in the moment it didn't seem that way it just no seemed no like no you just moment, were hopping yeah. from problem to problem to fix so that everybody yeah. was happy with you yeah well that, that was the that was my whole mentality growing up was i didn't want anyone hating me I wanted ah, everyone to just love me. So it was like yeah, mentally, yeah, it yeah, was yeah. constant. Yeah. If someone said, oh no, like I'm mad at you, it it killed me growing up. Because I was Man. like, what did I do? Like, oh, like dude. Now, now I, hey, so just curious to ask before you have to leave. Oh, yeah. um, okay, so was there a moment when it became clear to you that that wasn't going to work anymore? Or did you just go down this music journey, this music therapy almost to a point? that you are where you are today? It's or did you just say, hey, I gotta stop here or the music helped you or a combination? Was, definitely the music. It was the music that, just because like with music, what I love about, and this is, I think the reason why I got to this point was you're mm -hmm. free to write whatever you want. That was the biggest thing I understood when I started writing uh, music was I can I say you. what I want. Okay. I can yeah. do what I want. So I learned, I, I kind of like trained myself in music to just mm -hmm. say whatever. Right. And in and, and that mentality, you couldn't. like, for example, if someone told me back in the day when I was a kid, like, oh, yeah, like you said this and I'm offended. Back in the day, I would have went over the moon to try to fix it. Right. In music, I could be like, but like, OK, like it's just it's kind of like you can just express whatever you want. And then that got the characteristic where I was just like, OK, I don't have to please everybody at every moment of every time, because I know for a fact not everybody listens to my music. It's just the same yeah, thing yeah, it's like yeah. it, it's i don't not everybody will but those who those who will take the time to listen or will take the time to get to know me will then like what they see and hear yeah. and whatever so yeah. definitely you're gonna music. do really well on social media with that mindset because that's the mindset you gotta have in dealing with oh, yeah. life so do <laughs> yeah. you do you feel that maybe your perspective is a little bit broader now than it was before much much broader well the way i think of things is different like i can yeah. think of of aspects mo motions how to move how to move forward differently because how I to navigate to yeah right yeah, yeah. exactly and navigate the world and like social media is a big world i'm not gonna lie it's online 
uh, you can five thousand ways yeah, you yeah, yeah. five thousand people, and it's like so, yeah. like you know, imagine if you have that anxiety as a kid and then add social media to the to the platform. That's what happened to me. Like I went yeah. from yeah. add anxiety kid to Facebook, yeah. and it was like now the anxiety <laughs> went online. Dude. Like it was just, yeah. <laughs> it's more more bullies online than the right. ones in front of you. Yeah, it just yeah. increased. So you, yeah, and then it's very easy to take some text that you he read that someone sent you, and you think you're you're taking it twenty thousand miles away from what the meaning is. What, what actually it means in the moment, yeah. right? Exactly. Yeah. And so I, I, it's a lot of building, it's a lot of learning, and music was always the way that I was able to like express while well, listening to music and also writing and then sharing. I was able to kind of mold the mentality I have now. Okay, so bef before you step away, now that you you said these things, I have to do this to you because normally happens to everybody that comes on the show. And of yep. course, you trust me, and we've had a good conversation. So, uh, uh, not just now, but before, everybody has a moment where they get this. Look at the screen there. I'm going to put this up. Right. They get to give some advice on their way out. I wasn't going to do this to you, but now that you gave some great words of wisdom, Thank let's <laughs> uh, let's recap and solidify, make it concise. What would you say to young men? grown men mm. um tidbits tips of advice they find themselves in situations you've already left behind right what advice do you give now that you're looking back there's a uh there's an advice that is said all the time i like to say it and then kind of add to it it's the whole idea okay. of stay authentic um and, the, and what i mean about it is just it's my whole life was trying to be a person I thought someone else was was uh, I thought someone else needed me to be. So it was like I'm going to fix the problem, so I'm not the problem. I'm going to do this, so I'm not this. And so it's like okay. And then the problem is those you get this chasing where mm -hmm. you're trying to make them envision a person that you think they should see that they don't see. So for me, it's like the biggest advice I can give to any mm -hmm. anybody in any situation at all is stay true to you, mm -hmm. right? mm -hmm. and attract those who will accept you for you. It's it, and that's in everything from if you're going to do music, stay true to music and write yeah. music for those who are going to accept it. If you're going to do yeah. it in relationships, yeah. same thing. It's there's no point of molding yourself to something you're not because it's Bingo. very tough to keep to keep that act going. Spot like, on. Just, no, uh, man, you you're telling it, man. You're speaking truth because a person can easily start to they'll be chasing, man. They'll be chasing everybody. Right. They'll no, be chasing I'm, everybody. Yeah. It happens. I, on, I like you said social media too. It happens on social media a lot. Go ahead. You were going to say. No, 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 but I've ran, I've ran those roads. I've literally, I've chased every, before social media happened, that's all I was doing, was trying to chase gratis, gratification oh, from everything. And social wow. media came into the ropes and now you can do it instantly via a yeah. message or a poster. <laughs> <laughs> hey, you don't even get, you don't get an overnight or a few days. You no, get, no, it's just instant. <laughs> the, and then wait, not just once, they just keep yeah, coming. Yeah, <laughs> just, yeah, yeah. yeah. And it's just one, well, and the sad part, well, the negativity goes as fast as the positivity and it's just, yeah, it's it's, yeah. it's it's sad, but you got to remember the positive things because it's very easy to remember the negatives. Easy, right? Yeah, easy to let that creep in. It yeah. really and the negatives just immediately, whether you're a man or a woman. But speaking as a, as a guy right now, the negativity can latch itself onto insecurities yep. and low self esteem to yep. the point that a person will start to believe what that outside person said. This right. is crazy. No, no. Well, the thing, the funny part is, like, tell us, like, uh, everyone I talk to, it's like, our memories are connected by some sort of emotion that we have. But the biggest memories mm -hmm. that we always retain are the ones that were negative. Because we always, in this mindset, I never want to be in this position again. To remember that you never want to be in this position, you got to remember that position, which means you're constantly <laughs> remembering that negativity. Remembering it's, it's just, that moment, yeah. yeah you got to remember the memory to never be in that position. And so it's one of those things where it's like, yeah. In this in this world, <laughs> negative notions are so easily come, but we forget that positives do the same thing. The only difference is is we we don't think of those because it doesn't matter. I can think of I can I can always remember the show I bombed faster than the show that I kicked. Faster. You can remember it right now, can't you? <laughs> Almost like you can taste it and feel it, and experience it. Yeah, it, right then and there. And it's like it, no matter what, I can do. 30, 40, 50 amazing shows. Amazing I, shows. I, yeah. I'm one. And that one is what stays in my mind the whole time. <laughs> it's, 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 so. Make it positive. Okay. Positive. I, wish, I wish I could ex extract that uh, from your brain for you. But you know what? It's like remembering somebody, remembering they broke their leg or they got yeah. in a car accident. They're a little bit more careful the next time around. Exactly. Because that, that little hedge of stress is there. Exactly. Listen, exactly. no stress right now. Um, I hope for you. Anything you want to play on your way out? Anything like that? Or you get to go? Because, oh, you know, we, get, we got we got plenty. We're going to talk tomorrow or whatever, or whenever oh, we're yeah. going to talk or when we're done here, whatever the case may be. 
Uh, no, anything you want to, you want to, you want to, um, yeah, yeah, yeah go I ahead, man. Do your thing. Do your thing. This is, uh, this is my song called, uh, what am I supposed to do? Uh, I'm actually in Toronto right now. Um, I'm about to shoot the music video today and tomorrow. That's where I'm running yeah, to, to do shoot music videos. Cool. So this is called, uh, what am I supposed to do? I'm falling faster than the light I go from morning straight to night As I start to lose my sight I've forgotten where we've been All the places we had sinned Now I feel so cold within what am I supposed to do with this broken heart? My soul's on fire, but I'm in the dark. Where's the light? I need a spark to find you. What am I supposed to do when I got no plan? You got my life in the palm of your hand. You're the dealer, I'm just a man. What can I do? Have you ever seen a man fall to his knees? Eyes is crying, begging, please. Don't you leave, or oh, don't you leave. Have you ever had your heart broken in two and you don't know just what to do? You throw your fist in the air and say, what can I do? What am I supposed to do with this broken heart? My soul's on fire, but I'm in the dark. Where's the light? I need a spark to find you. What am I supposed to do when I got no plan? You got my life in the palm of your hand. And you're the dealer, I'm just a man. What can I do? What do I do? What do I do? What do I say to get through to you? I have no space in this life without you. What do I do? What do I do? What do I say to get through to you? I have no space in this life without you. What am I supposed to do with this broken heart? My soul's on fire when I'm in the dark. Where's the light? I need a spark to find you. What am I supposed to do when I got no plan? You got my life in the palm of your hand And you're the dealer, I'm just a man What can I do? There you go, thank you so much Thank you so much Again, you guys can find me everywhere On uh, Spotify, Apple Music, Instagram, Facebook, everything My name is Almir Jules um, I I really 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 want to come to Cali. I'd be down to do a live show there. That'd be that's that's the plan. So yes, it. Hundred percent. That's it. We we go, yeah. man. We gonna talk. Oh yeah. <laughs> we got <laughs> we got some. We go. Right, thank gonna you so do much. What we do. Me. Listen, man. This is uh this is perfect timing. Uh, somebody got some love for you on the screen. They're giving you a compliment. Uh, oh, awesome. I put most of them up. You're gonna you're gonna be able to see uh, quite a few of them when you uh, look back. Uh, but uh, it says that uh, Dr. Pepper 76 says uh, this has got somewhat of an 80s R&B vibe to it. Ah, this nice. is pretty good. He, he drops that to you. And uh, man, everybody, uh, they're telling you very good point that you made earlier talking about relationships. Right. It's all there. What I'm looking forward, I am thrilled to be able to get a chance to talk with you again. We had a good talk the other day right. and uh, before the show. I'm looking forward to showcasing you. Uh, on our, our new music channel and uh, some other a number of other things. Hopefully, you can be a part of some of the live events that we're going to be sponsoring and putting on as well. That's uh, a plan. Our Rhythm Entertainment uh, Media Group will be doing uh, my daughters. Um, thank you, man. I, I I'm just uh, really appreciate you capping off this time, uh, having Grace uh, with us uh, first, um, and um, both of you, amazing thank people. You. And I'm glad I met you and yeah, glad I saw your music. Same. Right. Thank you so again. Thank you so much for having me, and thank thank you to your daughters and oh, everything. <laughs> uh, no, we uh, we we got you, man. We we are gonna talk. We are gonna talk. Oh yeah. 100%. So we gonna talk. Thank you. Thank you everybody for being here. But uh, watch out for this guy. I'm telling you, watch out for this guy. Um, I'm gonna collect all my aluminum cans and support you, man. We gonna we gonna get some. We gonna get some. Get some. Get some. Some. Do a little something. Some. Keep it up. Talk to you soon, man. I'll see you later. Thank you. Thank Same you so way. much. Uh, thank see you. you later. Much love to you, man. 
care what you think of me You can throw me into the sea Wrap the rope right around my feet Watch me drown so gently Drag my name around all through the town And act like you don't know me I'm the crazy little wannabe So go ahead and get away from me Better off on my own Like being alone I never check my phone Cause there's no room for you no more Yeah, you were never right Would you change my life? You're my kryptonite And I don't need you tonight Girl, keep moving Keep moving on I've had to change up my own life It's time I've walked in my own stride I'm better losing I'm better losing you If you're wondering why life is so clue, It's because of you Sweet, <laughs> really good. Sweet, brother. Really good. Get ready. Here, here it comes. Here it comes. Ah, uh, <laughs> it's called a standing ovation. Virtual studio standing ovation. There you go. Nice. Woo-hoo.